Hello and welcome back. So, we are currently in the process of building our great castle and our great sacrificial temple over here. Uh, we're currently in the preparation for a sandstorm that's probably going to destroy way too much. Uh, we have extra housing over here in preparation. Unfortunately, we do have a ridiculous amount of homeless. But that's not going to cover it. <laughs> also, we were boosting up the number of building materials to try and prepare for the sandstorm that's due in. Now, unfortunately, building the houses, which we need to do, is also taking away the building materials that we need for the preparation for the reinforcement. So, damned if we do, damned if we don't. There isn't really any good way around this, unfortunately. So, we're going to just commit to building houses at this moment. Uh, we also, I think, on last episode, completed all the tech trees at the moment. And we are just praying and hoping that some of the resources that were lacking come in like the mulberry or the cattle oh sorry cows for the uh, milk they're definitely what we're struggling on at the moment all right that should do for that let's just do a road here and let's do a cheeky little road there Take a little road there, and a road there, and that will do for a short while. Okie dokie. No new events happening at this present moment in time, so we're fine on most things. Uh, so yeah, we've got... What is that? A mountain warehouse? A what? I can build a warehouse in a mountain? Interesting. Oh, I kind of want to do that. I'm going to build one there. And then, I suppose we could build a mountain warehouse here. Yeah. I don't need these things, but I want to see what they look like. <laughs> We do also have a shelter up, actually, thinking about it. I don't know if I need to activate it or whether people just go into that shelter whenever there's a... a catastrophe that's happening or something like that. I don't actually know, so... There's going to be another thing that we're going to find out shortly. a cellar. Huh. What would I use? We I mean, could try a cellar. Just for giggles and just to see what it looks like. I think that is everything covered off, I think. Yeah, we've but, excuse me. Found everything. We're just waiting for these to be built to see exactly what they look like. Right, sandstorm. Year out on that. How much silver do I actually have at the moment? Oh, we're upgrading the quarry there. Okay. Silver is fine. I could build more cutlery. Cuttlefish. Uh, and do some extra cuddlery. Mineral rich. Thank you. Thank you. Nice new achievement down there. What 
does the berry do? Let me click off that, please. Go away. The berry, I cannot... Oh. I must not be able to unlock it in this game mode. Okay, so we're looking for... A production. It's probably under treasury. Jewelry. Leatherworking. Soap. Farmy. Farmy? Yes, that's the word I was looking for. Farmy. Uh, pottery. Yeah, of course, because that's what I thought it was going to come under. Pottery. So, the pottery, does that classify under ore? It does. Okay. So let's build those there. We have another... Oh, I'm up to three pips on the happiness. I've not seen a three pip bonus. Doesn't really matter, but it's nice to see that we have it. Uh, people's stress is still through the roof at the moment. Right, so north, east, west, or south. Where's the sandstorm going to hit? It seems to love coming in from this angle, so I'm presuming it's going to be over here. If it comes from this way and the sandstorm can be counteracted. Man, if we could fleek out and it just goes along that edge. That would be amazing. It's not going to happen, though. Uh, that storage is full. Um, okay. I can't really do a lot about that at the moment. No. Can I do terraforming and can I clear off that? Yes, I can. Should I? Mm -hmm. That is not for me to answer. So let's do a mountain warehouse here. Yeah, we could get loads of extra mining over here just by doing terraforming. Uh, there's none there. Can we destroy the mine? No, mines are not demolishable. Okay. Right. Wish me luck, everyone. The uh, storm is going to hit momentarily I mean if you're gonna give me a giant sandstorm game at least give me a, a cow or mulberry seeds from this merchant ship that's turning up at least do me a favor yeah we're still down at 342 whoa whoa that is a giant sun Whoa. Uh, that is going to hurt. Which way is it going? Okay, so that is a huge footprint. Okay. okay so there we go. Taking that out. Uh, probably want to. I can't reinforce that. That's already reinforced. So we're getting into this district. Luckily, a lot of them are already reinforced here, so bonus. What is it now? Let's 
see what angles is going to come through at. Okay, it's coming through here. It seems to be about here. Yeah, because it's just wiped that out. How many of these do I actually have now? Not enough is the short answer. some of this production. It's turned, it's now going this way. Of course it is. You have the materials in it. Do your job, slow it down. Okay, so those trees there have really reduced it quite nicely. Um, okay, I can reinforce that. Yeah, it looks like the trees here on this edge here did definitely do some form of defense. So, yay me. Oh, it's going to go straight through the cemetery. Okay. It's freed up some space in the cemetery. that building. Someone is having a laugh. I'll, yeah, I will take that. I am happy with the outcome. And we did technically lose some population, which Yeah, we're down to 181 citizens needing houses now. Bonus? Right. I already have every point spent into here, so what is the point of the research institutes if I have everything researched? It's not like I can do a proficiency and bonus up with extra points into it. I wonder if that's something they're going to bring in in a, in a uh, later update. Like specifying the town to be a merchant town or a harvesting town. So you can get a bonus in one of the tech trees. Right, maple sap. Maple sap. Interesting. Uh, a sheep, a horse, and a chicken. I don't need them, but... They're a rare item, 
so I'm gonna have to get it. Also, let's grab as much domestic fuel as we can, might as well. How much money have I got at the moment? A decent amount. Let's get 300 units of the oil. Steel tools, yeah. Let's buy a thousand of them. Uh, let's do 200 glass bottles. Um, yeah, everything else I should be fine on. So let's just transfer over 68,280. The annual imports. Okay, so we now have extra... Uh, what do we call it? Uh, options here. So we can't do horses in there. So we can do... Eggs obtained through trade. these animals out? Can I transfer those to... That's that one. Mm. I could just build another set of corrals. I don't have to. So where the heck is the cor corral is here? Let's rotate that and put you here. You there. And then you here. Now, we could also grow some grain and do some fodder here. Tempted to do that, actually. So, let's have a look at the farm. Let's do a farm here. 15 by 15 is max size. There we go. And then let's build the fodder factory there. And we will build a fodder factory there. And then technically we could also do a stone road. there. And that way. Oh, can't build it that way. We're going to have to run that way down here. Yeah, that will do. Then the fodder can feed into there. Interesting. And let's -a go. Right, so they're being rebuilt. Oh, wait. They need to be rebuilt? Didn't I click on that? Obviously not. Or maybe it just destroyed itself due to... Uh, low health. I don't think the words would not form then. So the cutstone is definitely coming in. Uh, the that mine. Oh, that mountain quarry has run out. Um. Well, in that case, we could build another mountain quarry. However, before I do that, I need to terraform that edge and that edge. Then a mountain quarry would go... Oh, come on, rotate. There. there. And we need to terraform that edge down. Yep, 
Yep, that'll do. And then we can do another mountain quarry. I mean, technically, could we do a mountain warehouse? Could, but probably shouldn't. We have enough resources anyway. And we have a bunch of warehouses there, so... Yeah, I don't feel the exact need to build more there. We have... Let's have a look at that. Uh, to be fair, it does have quite a lot of stone already. No, 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 no. Stone cutter is over here. Masonry workshop. Okay. So all right. Scream if you see the masonry workshop before I do. I'm gonna guess you are gonna see it before me because I am blind. There it is. That'll do. Ooh, we have a great harvest due in. Very much would like that. Uh, let's get an extra person on the apiary. Might as well. Still waiting to be built. Um, I can take everyone off that now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's just the butter shops. Can't do anything with that yet. Ooh. Yeah, we can take people off the, the mines there. The mines of Moria. going to need to do, I think, the deep dish mines, just so we can actually set it up and forget about it. So let's do one there, and then I could realistically do with one here. However, that front is blocked. So, couldn't fit it in there if we tried. Yeah, there's no way I can fit that in there, even if I rearrange stuff. just terraform this edge off a bit. Okay, so we can do that mine there. I mean, I have metric ton of capacity for mining. 
we have it being done, it's just we could always do with more. Okay, that's upgraded. Oh, we have a animal plague due in. Lovely. We're getting so close on that stand. But stone. We will fix that. That is yeah, that is gonna fix itself very shortly. Kinda of looking forward to see those two buildings up and running. Citizens are thirsty. Uh, what are we doing here? Coal? Uh, no. Uh, we'll just stick with the regular wood, I think, at the moment. I could have a look at how much coal I have. Shop, what do we want to make? We could make porcelain. I haven't looked at that, that's just a trade item, but I mean, I'm gonna make it. person on it because we have it it's just running a little bit short on gathering Ooh. all right let's get you in there um chickens and then in here we will do horse can we do sheep in this field no okay so that one's gonna have to be sheep then do sheep there actually. Let's start the sheep. Said nobody before. I have robo chickens by the sounds of it. Right, so that's up and running. Kiln here. Um, bricks. I have loads of glass. We need bricks. And we'll get some tables up. And we'll put the bricks in. And we'll make sure it can't be destroyed. Oh, I can't do that yet. Fishing net and cocoa beans. Okay. I'll take that. Right, we have run out of tea leaves. So, do we have cocoa beans? Coffee beans? Coffee beans. Right, so that field is up. Can we do. Okay, so we can do extra horses. Mm. Horse meat. N no, I, I. I'll be honest. I don't want to eat the horses. I'm thinking more of transportation, not nourishment. Uh, 
There, there are countries that eat it. Uh, horse meat. No, it's illegal in England. Right, okay, here we go. We can... I'm going to put four people on that fodder. And we are going to do... Peas and corn. Peas and corn. Corn and peas. And you can be corn. And just put everyone on it. What is that fodder? Oh, do I want fodder? Yeah, we do have a decent amount here actually, so let's get more people on fodder. Right, so that's built. That was for just regular soap, if I remember correctly. So let's get you on that. Let's put an extra person on it. And we have you. You were doing medical soap. So let's do that. Do we have the tables to put an extra person on it? Yes, we do. Okay, good. Right, so have we rebuilt? We have rebuilt. How much coal have I got? Um, I'm going to do coal. And um, that one, we will use timber. Yeah, that's all those up and running. Mm, yeah, we'll put it on grow and harvest, actually, yeah. Okay, so it went through that hook. It did. Uh, let's do the trap, see if we can get any extra cubs out. Mm -mm -mm. Right, let's use H, turn the trees off. And then we're looking for any extra random events like the, the bear that I saw the other day. Probably not going to get one because we just had the floating crate. Not seeing anything. And don't see any giant trees either. <laughs> okay, let's see. Merchant ship, are you going to be friendly? There's another merchant ship in in short succession, actually. Huh, okay. Uh, we can apply as many people onto that. Let's get a load of people on that as well. Oh, wait. I need to take everyone off that. There's no stone on that. It's these that I need the people on. There we go. And has that merchant ship turned up? Not yet. It will be, though. If I don't pause the game. So let's have a look. Blueprint. Uh, increases the system's life. It what? Ancient trees which slightly reduce citizens' birth spacing. Uh, no. No. Increases 
Wait, what is that? Totem. Uh, yeah, let's buy a few of those. Uh, iron tools. Probably do need a few of those, so let's buy 200 of them. Uh, we can buy a few ovens, to be fair. And that is kind of yeah, I think. Okay, so 59, 400. There we go. That'll do. Okay, so decorative buildings that can be built in towns. Okay, so they're not particularly big, so that's good. So let's build you there. I don't know what the spacing requirement is on this. However, we're just going to build a few in a few population hubs. We should have one or two over in this area here as well. We need roads going through here. Ooh, that temple's getting close to being finished. Oh, wait, I need a lot more building kits and a lot more cut stone. Luckily, we are already on the case. Ooh, that needs next person there. The bricky bricks. That is... We'll do coal for that fueling station. Right, that one is missing a production chain. We use flax for making rope. Right, I think that's everyone built. You're making porcelain, you're making extra jewellery. We have the people rebuilt over here. We have our... Horses up and running. Or we will. Once we get a few extra horses, we'll transfer some into that uh, corral. We just need them to start breed. Breeding. Yeah, I'm happy with how that has gone so far. Probably you've all found that quite entertaining. We're still on the chase for the mulberry and the cattle, or cows, sorry. But the sandstorm that hit us, yes, did do damage, but it wasn't horrific. We did manage it quite well, and it did go through a bunch of trees, so there are some benefits. Right, well, we're going to continue with the population growth hopefully get these built further along and we'll see what happens with the animal plague and what merchant ships we can get in here to see if we can try and fully unlock all of the production chains or not all of them but get into the actual silk works and the cattle so we can make the delicacy foods and stuff like that that's the main goal at the moment just trying to tech up food and clothing that's really where we're kind of lacking at the moment. Well, thank you for joining. Take care, and I'll catch you on the next one.